Hello everybody, this is a sit and talk, just a really quick update on the channel. Um, first of all, right outside that window there we've got a building site. You might notice I've moved where I do the recording away from the harsh window, but it's also to get away from the building site. I've left the windows open so you might be able to pick up the noise, because it's quite hot today, and I want you to be able to hear the kind of nonsense that goes on outside my window, because I come in from work you know, it's so about seven o'clock or something like that, and they're already banging on the windows and doors and stuff like that, and making a right racket out there. And I've got to sleep through it, and I've also got to make videos with them doing that as well. So that's where the noise comes in. Um, regarding all the things I said I needed to do, like getting a carpet down, oven in, that's done. I've done that. All my previous targets have been met now. Now we can just go forward and enjoy life. Um, I need to get some lights up here, you know, I've got some Tungsten light here, if you can see, you know, and um, that's where you get the orange look, and um, I want to get some LEDs for up there, so I can just flip a switch, bang, it's on, mics running and everything, get a boom down here, so I can just swing it around when I need it, uh, that kind of thing. So, things should start to improve, because now, we, now I can do that. Uh, I do want to actually focus on trying to get transport, you know, for my uh, getting to and from work, as in a motorbike. That's one of the things high up on my list. Uh, I got a monitor because my old monitor broke. That wasn't something I was planning on, but it was on the list. It was just a bit lower down. So it's been a bit of an expensive month, but things have got done. Things have progressed as a result. So, I mean, I've got a new computer as well, obviously. So we've done quite a lot this year already, and even more to follow. So yeah, on course, everything working. Um, the channel is basically get, becoming more of a gamer's chat channel, you know, with uh, modding and uh, mental health. Because mental health is an issue for gamers. I mean, they might deny it because they don't want to face the fact that they're going crackers. But so lots, a lot of gamers are going down that road because they are letting themselves you know, immerse themselves in this game and then the game is making them angry and then they're coming out of the game into the real world and getting angry. And I'm a gamer too. I've been a gamer longer than most people have been alive and I know this is true. So let's not bullshit each other on the topic because I know this is true and I know it affects people and it's affected me in the past. So let's just assume this is correct and not argue the point, right? Um, on the topic of t uh, gaming in videos and stuff, you might notice it's the, the videos I've been doing so far have been quite varied. I mean, they've got like my kind of modding community for Starfield, which is what I want to build so that you guys know what I'm after doing. Um, modder interactions, learn to make mods, sit and talk players will be players. And uh, AMD drivers, PC controls, and I, I'm a PC user. I will be making a video about you know keyboard and mouse controls um, soon, right? So you'll get to see that. Uh, I don't use game pads. There's one there about hard drives coming up. Um, it's just some important points if you're thinking of uh, building your system because there's the what people say you should get and what's practical on your budget. <laughs> and um, this is more of a practical on your budget kind of talk about the important things to look for and how you benefit so it's, it's for those people that aren't familiar with techie stuff but want to just upgrade the system a little bit um, and I've got a modders tale that tells how uh, I converted um, how I converted the anger and the hate from me trying to help people when there was too many people asking for help and not enough of me to go around you know, and the players just basically not helping themselves by reading previous posts or docs or watching videos or reading tutorials. How I turned all of that anger into something that became a gameplay feature of my mods. It's an interesting tale, but it tells you, you know, there are two ways of dealing with that kind of anger and you know, hot toxicity. And you can make it into a positive thing. So that's going on. I am trying to make this channel a positive influence on gaming. By tackling some issues that gamers are just in denial about, and um, I think it's going to be a major theme of the site as it, well, the channel as it goes forward. Because let's face it, right, gamers lie to themselves about who they are, what's going on in their heads, their own ability to socialise, and I'm a straight shooter. I will tell it as it is. You know, I'm not. I'm not rude with it generally, unless the person deserves it. But um, I do like to be honest with myself. And I think gamers need to be honest with themselves too. 
So anyway, um, that's what the channel's going to be doing while we wait for Starfield anyway. So let's get on with it and I'll see you in the next one.